When I throw on this uniform, I'm not a unicorn. You know I got to go to work. As you guys already know, airport, here I go. Because this is how it works. Oh, will my airline say, Diego, take off the rest of the day. Oh, what will my airline say? You can have it off with pay. No way. All right, ladies and gentlemen, so I am at the airport. Finally, the time right now is 10.49 a.m. in Arizona. We're in Phoenix, okay. So, yeah, so uh, that was in the bathroom of my friend's house. It's a beautiful house, by the way. I couldn't show you guys the whole house, but um, I'm gonna start visiting him more often. I've known him since 2016, so he's a, a really good friend of mine. And he just asked me to keep his privacy, well, his face off camera, so you gotta respect someone's wishes. Okay, so I stopped at a Starbucks, guys. All right, my drink, ice, and then I got the sausage, egg, and bacon wrap. And then you can see everyone here going to their gates. It's kind of busy right now. All right, so uh, I need to go check in for my flight. So they'll start boarding in 10 minutes, so I'm going to head over there. But I had a good time with him. Like I said, we watched the town halls commentary. Uh, I fell asleep, but y'all saw me on the couch because like I said, I sleep cold. I can't, I don't do warm temperatures. I have to be cold to go to sleep. So I had a hard time sleeping. Maybe I might sleep on this aircraft, I don't know. But yeah, guys, I go on reserve tomorrow. I think I start a six day reserve block. Let me see, today's the 16th. 17, 18, 19, 20, 21, 22. Yes, I started a six day reserve block. So, with a six day reserve block, anything can happen. They can assign me a couch. Who knows, y'all? But you know, I'm always trying to bid, always trying to get my coins up. So, that's what I will be actively doing. So, again, I'm ahead of my gate, and I know I can get on this flight. There's a lot of open seats, but anything can happen, guys. So, we're supposed to be on the A321 which is our largest aircraft. Uh, hopefully I get an extra roll, who knows? But anyways, I'll be with you when I get settled on the aircraft. I'm gonna speak into existence, so you guys stay tuned. All right, ladies and gentlemen, so I'm on the aircraft and I got a window seat in our stretch seating, so it's 3A. And here's the uh, weather out here in Arizona. So you see JetBlue, it is hot out here, guys. Very hot out here. Okay, so it's hour 15 back to Arizona. So I'm just gonna sit here and chill, mind my business. Um, I forgot to bid for my November schedule, guys. I totally forgot, so it's closed. I have a really good feeling November is gonna be a really bad month because I didn't bid. So I don't know what days I'm gonna have off, what days that I'm gonna be on reserve. I made that mistake and I just checked. It is closed, but guys, uh, I will be with you when I get to Arizona or get to Denver. I'm gonna listen to uh, gospel music. Jonathan McReynolds, I love him. You need to check out his music. He makes really good inspirational music, guys, but they are getting ready to board. And remember, this is a A321, 230 passengers max, 41 rows of seats. So yes, guys, I'm gonna be jamming back to Denver, but I will be with you when I get there. So stay tuned.
Of course, I arrived safely in Denver, and the local time right now is 4.12 p.m. So guys, I stopped at Walmart. Walmart is, well, let me show you. Walmart is over there. And so now I'm at a, a gas station putting uh, gas in a crash pad car. I went to Walmart to get some new shoes for my job, some uh, socks, you know, the trouser socks that I wear. Okay, looks like it's full. Cool. And to get a couple other things, guys, but that's what I'm doing here just before I go to the crash pad. Now, the flight from... Uh, Uh, Phoenix to Denver was hour 15. I told you guys fueling complete. What's the receipt? Uh oh, okay, printing a receipt. Okay, so all right, I gotta post this, but yeah, uh oh, yeah, hour 15. So there's a flight attendant on there that I've flown with a few times. I've seen her, and so I told her after work we can go get like maybe some drinks. Well, not drinks because I don't drink, but you know, stop at Applebee's. Let me take a picture of this. I got to take a picture of the gas, how much I put in, but yeah. So that's what we're gonna do. So I just had to make a couple of quick stops here and then I'm gonna head to the crash pad. Let me see. All right, give me a second, guys. Taking a picture. Okay, so I got that in here. But yeah, so that's what we're gonna do, ladies and gentlemen. So I'm in a rush right now. Let me head and get changed. There's a couple of things that I could do today. But one thing I did want to show you guys is the sky out here. Let me show you. It is so beautiful right now. Y'all see that? Look how pretty it is. I think that's smoke, if I'm not mistaken. I am not sure. This sky, this sky looks like real dirty. But that is beautiful. Yeah, it's an absolutely beautiful setting, guys. But yeah, so uh, I go on reserve again tonight, six days. I did bid for a trip that I probably won't get because it's not day for day. Yeah, I'm pretty sure I won't get it. But you never know, I still put my bid in. But yeah, guys, that's what's really going on right now in Denver. I'm just gonna go to the crash pad. Now, if I don't hook up with her, I do have a guy who wants to take me out on a date. So I told you guys, it's all about dating being single, me being a flight attendant. You know, and the cool thing about this job, and I tell you guys all the time, is you have an option to get up and go. Now, if you don't have attachments like me, the getting up and going is a lot easier. So, that's what I like to do, ladies and gentlemen, but. Okay. I'm getting this car. Okay, so. Yeah, so that, that's gonna wrap up, guys, my little quick visit to Arizona. So if you like what you've seen, you guys can go ahead and like, comment, and subscribe, share the video. Um, yeah, who is this? Oh, shoot, it's her. So guys, I'll be with you later. This is her probably calling me to see where am I at. So guys, yeah, to my next adventure, thank you guys for rocking with me, and I love you all, all the Ford Explorers. If you're new to my channel, if you're an OG, I do appreciate your support. And y'all, I mean, this is a journey, okay? Sometimes the journey is beautiful, sometimes it's ugly. Right now, guys, I am in between. So when I tell guys or when someone explains someone that's all right, that is like a, a great up from ugly. So right now, I'm in the all right stage in my career. One day, it's going to be very beautiful, and you guys should be here to see it. But thank you guys. Signing off from a gas station near Walmart in Thornton, Colorado. I love y'all. Bye.